Hi, thank you for joining today's session. In today's session, I will show you how you can add a function button and a touch a bass print macro with the B1 usability extension. The B1 usability extension uh, is part of the B1 usability package. So if I go into SAP Business One, I'm going to inventory and I'm pulling up the item report. You see, I already have several uh, buttons right here. So usually, if you want to print something, uh, for example, a label, what you do is you highlight maybe the, um, the line, you right click, you click the print button, you click preview, and then you choose your report, print label, and click OK, and then you put in your parameters. So that's about five clicks or more. Okay. You can save time by just creating a button, attach it to the button, and you just need one click uh, for that feature. So let's create a button. If I right click right here, I'm going to this icon, which is the best usability extension uh, icon, and I'm going to click edit function button. So you will see all those buttons I already have on that screen here, but I would like to add another one. I'm going to click Add Row, and I'm going to call it Label. And I'm also going to call it uh, Label on my Info uh, column. That's just more information for you. I'm not assigning an ID because the IDs will get assigned once I click the Add or Update button. Okay, I'm going to leave everything the same label. You could put a tooltip in there if you have a button and need more information um, about this button for the user. You can actually put in a tooltip. Um, I'm just going to put more info so you see it. And you can also choose which user has access to all those buttons. So you can design the screen for, a, for certain users and then you can do another screen design for different users. So here I'm creating the button and now I have to link the function. Once I click on this button, what do I want it to do? So if I click right here on this equal sign, you see all those different functions. You know, you can create new functions straight from here. They are called Best Universal Function, and that, that can be a message, that can be a SQL report to attach, or a script, or an external launcher. But in this case, we actually want to add, attach a print macro, which was created in Best. That's a Best feature. Okay? And you see, my I have three print macros set up, and one is called the label. So I'm going to highlight it and I am going to click transfer. So I am attaching this print macro to my button. I can drill back from here and check it out and you see there's my macro. All it is is I attached a, a report, a crystal report right here and then I have some variables in here. I'm going to click End, and I'm going to click Refresh Window, and you will see the button appearing to my right. I'm keeping my button to the right also, the new button. And here it is. So here's my label button. So what this does, if I click on a label, uh, on an item, and I click Label, you see right here, it's one click, and your report comes up. I put the palette number, I put a batch number and I put a quantity and click start. So one click you have your parameters and the report will be generated. Compare if you have to right click and use um, and use the other way you have like five or more clicks. Here is my report. And you also saw if I hover the mouse over it, this is like a tooltip. More info in my case, but if there's something you need to let the user know, give him a little bit more information. So just one click compared to right click, uh, click on the um, print icon, click on preview, click on print level, 
label and then you have your input a screen. You can save all those clicks just by creating a button and attach the uh, print macro to the button. Thank you so much for joining today. I hope uh, you like this session. Have a wonderful day.